Okay, so here's half of our stuff. We're about to move in now. Um, and I already have an idea of like where I want to put everything. So I'm actually going to put clothes in this section first. Let me put that thing back. What I love is that we actually just like use random things to pack because everything was so small But the first section I'm starting out with is all of Dimitri's clothing and I had it in like this collapsible laundry basket And then in like this bubble wrap that I got in one of these like van packages I put my clothes and that was me unpacking them And then I started saving all this like random stuff like tiny boxes for my mentor because I thought we were gonna go see her But we're actually gonna see her in October um, And just like other random things that I was gonna donate and then right here I was packing up all the mason jars which is pretty easy because I just have like this open mason jar shelf so and then that box had all of our like cat things and toiletries and this was like all of our bathroom stuff and then that's my favorite bag that black quilted one that's insulated that's our um, food shopping bag and then this lunch bag we ended up giving that away which I regret because I could have gave it to a homeless person um, and then the books were actually the hardest most time consuming and boom there's Cass how many of you guys saw her before this frame um started <laughs> but yeah like there was way too many books we had to pare down dramatically um somebody asked me if Cass escapes out of the van she will try to but she's actually on a leash if we have the doors open hi Casso hi good girl so so far this is what I've done I've um I filled up like the bookcase with all the books um, except for these, um, which are very thick. I'm actually thinking about donating this one now. Um, I've never read it, but I've seen the documentary. Um, this is our cat, which was her sister. Um, so I don't know where I would like, where I'm gonna put her. Yeah, I don't know, that's kind of a good spot. Dimitri's gonna have whatever he has in his office supplies. And in here, I'm gonna have like miscellaneous stuff in this drawer, and in that drawer, I'm gonna have our clothes, which is really full right now. We have to find a better way to organize it. Um, on here, I have all of Dimitri's books from work, which these aren't even all of them. We were gonna give a lot back to the to the facility, and he would just go and pick them up, but these are all of the books, and they don't fit. Then I have four of my cookbooks. I actually have five. One of them's in the house, and Dimitri has his artist books right here, and other people's artist books that he was given, and I have this book that my friend gave me. Um, and then we have like our mason jar, so that's like the cat food, and this was going to be our food on this side. So pretty much we didn't really do anything else. Um, this is going to be like bathroom and toiletries and stuff, but I don't really know what to do with it right now. So we have more stuff in the house, and we're going to get that, I guess, later when we actually move in. Hi. Hey. Watch some water. Thank you. I'm thirsty. I know. Okay, so this is actually the last thing that we're going to take into the van. Um, it's just like random stuff, and actually most of it is for sale. So, yeah, we're going to take this one in today. And, like, this is basically what we're working with with the apartment. It's super empty. Oh, let me turn on this light. Act like I got some sense. Super empty. Um, and we've just been living with this fan, these blankets, this mattress, our two pillows. This is a stack of, like, laptops and journals and uh, some reading materials, some... Um, a whole bunch of tech stuff in that bag. This is like wardrobe changes. Uh, I have to return that hot glue gun. These dumbbells because I've been working on my guns. You feel me? And our cat, our cat's bag right there. The tripod. That's pretty much everything that we're living with. And then here is this. It's all empty. All empty. Look at Dimitri. That's the boo boo stinks. Um, here's this side. Got to put a doorknob in. Um, Almost set the house on fire and had to break that door and to come in and replace the entire door. Oh, this box, which my cat loves. I might actually bring this into the van <laughs> as a permanent fixture for a while because she loves this box. And then she goes and she like sucks on this teddy bear right here who is um, a cat. His name is Calico Teds. And then we have like just some random weird toys. And coming over here, this is like our cat's bowl and uh, water bowl and the fridge and stuff. And then over here we have like a whole bunch of recycle, my partner's phone, our pots. This is the Berkey. This is me. Uh, this is like all the stuff that we're living with. This plant. Which I don't think that this plant is growing. It's growing. Um, it's third leaf. It must be growing at like a very slow rate. I don't know. But yeah, we're living with like that big mason jar of like um, tools. Oh, right here. This is the only cabinet that we have full, which we just washed these dishes. Um, that's like Cass's food, some bowls. 
that cup and this is our cookie cup guys okay and then here are our like plates and bowls and then right here is just like this has been our pantry <laughs> this is like all of our food and then boom in the bathroom this is like everything else um we have my my partner's towel my towel is like behind the door and then we have like an extra tissue roll and some hydrogen peroxide for my partner's wounds that he just um obtained while he was running and then we have like all of this stuff which Carmen gave us thank you so much Carmen still using it <laughs> so that's pretty much it now we're gonna go move that stuff into the van we're gonna live here for about like two more days or something I'm looking over here instead of here maybe three yeah two or three days I think that we're gonna live in the van for a month before I actually show a tour of the stuff in the van aside from the burgie and this bowl and cast and ourselves we have like everything moved in now into the van and now the hard part is securing everything inside the van because it's a moving vehicle and that's the part I've been really stressed about for like two days um, I don't know how to like go about doing certain things so we're about to go figure that out now all right so we're moving in um, and we're realizing some little details so we affixed that's our, our, um, our dead cat that's her ashes and so we like affix that there with like a staple in the back and just some string so hopefully that works I don't know if it's going to and then Dimitri is gonna put up these like little cup hooks right here one cup hook two cup hook one here one here so that when this desk is open I'm gonna affix a copper wire here with staples and it'll be able to hold itself up like that and I could do like cute stuff like I said in my last video And then the other thing that we figured out is um, the same thing, like a staple and a string. And that's where we have our toothbrushes, our tongue scraper, our eye wash cup, and some toothpaste. And just like two crystals that we were given by two different people. And then we did this, but this one is actually the worst because it really doesn't hold as well as those do. Um, so that'll be banging around like while we're driving. It's kind of annoying. I don't really know what to do with it in this specific moment. But yeah, moving process. Lots of stuff, lots of stuff. And then she decided to grace us with her beauty. Oh my gosh, Cass was with our landlord in her space. <laughs> Look at her little paw. Ay, que linda la nena. So this is what I have here for um, the way that our, like that hook is working. I don't really know how I'm gonna like affix the copper wire. I already have like a staple in it, but yeah, that's what's going on. And um, I got to do this side for Dimitri's section. And then he's actually doing the little shelf right here. He's cutting it right now for this mason jar of our kitchen. Where we totally have to get a new ladle um, because it's so messed up. And like it's all like rusted and stuff on the inside. So hopefully I can thrift one that's steel. Okay, so this is like we just finished basically moving in as much as possible. And now um, we actually meal prepped some granola yesterday while, while we were still cooking in the in the house. So I'm just making some chocolate milk so we could have like peanut butter granola inside and some sliced bananas. I hope. We're tired and hungry and Dimitri has to get to work now. Look at Cass. That's how we feel. 